everyone, welcome to a new vlog. I'm at Kolbung Basti and I'm exploring my new world. Uh, this is Nazi. Very few people walk on this road, and this is how it looks. It's a beautiful place. We've been trekking for a long time right now. And we have walked through very small roads. And we've come through the jungle. And here, Shrenivella and her sisters, her cousins, they're all resting for a while. It's a beautiful place. The most famous organic vegetable found in Darjeeling and around Darjeeling. This is how the farming is done. This is a squash or iskus in Nepali language. This is a place with very few people residing. After walking for a long time, we finally found our own house here. Away from the hustle and bustle of the city and the honking of the horns. This is pla a place where you can find solace. Yes, Renevela. <laughs> If you look at these roads, you can hardly find any people walking. And there's greenery, beautiful sunlight. And here's my daughter. Okay. Again. <laughs> Again. And I'm taking the videos for her because I want to be, I mean, I want her to be close to nature. I don't want her to use any gadgets here, so... This is a monastery in Nezi. After walking uphill, we've reached the place and see how beautiful it looks. Gold temple. Monastery. Oh, it's a monastery. Gold is gold. Yes. We are trying to be taro. Do you all? The same general which will allow the mafia. Not only that. Shani's Agu tells us that this house is only made of mud. No bricks have been used. It's not a house actually, it's a monastery. Please look at this people. See how beautiful it looks. Where is it? 
there is one monk who is studying here. Yeah, on this side. Okay, now we are entering the monastery. Look at the carvings on the stones. This monastery was built in 1860. Two. 1862 is what my brother-in-law told me just now since he is a he is a resident of this place and he knows about the history of this place unfortunately we could not enter the monastery because it was locked and the head monk is not here at the moment we spoke to the small monk that we met a while ago and told us that the head monk is not here so he will not be able to open the monastery for us look at this beautiful place you have to pull the door shreni to open it There's my brother-in-law talking to a monk. This is Samir's place and these are the animals that he has in his farm. You can see the cow here. Shrenivela, how was the cow milk? How was it? Yummy. Yummy. <coughs> Shreni got a chance to drink pure cow's milk without adding a single drop of water. And she's very happy here. <laughs> she doesn't want to go back home. Okay, so that's the cow. And as we come here, we can see the goats. We can also show you the beehive. Yes. These are the goats. 
munch 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 they're all munching even the little rabbits yes they are this is a beehive we're standing a little far because we're scared of the bees they might sting us and here we have cute bunnies how many bunnies are here Shrini? there are four four or five no it's four because one died oh is it mm. can you please hold this that, I mean, i'll try and open the cage okay. Let's just hope no Here they are. <laughs> Hello. Five of you. No, four of you. One, two, three, four, five. No. Yes. One, one. Yeah, lots and lots. <laughs> <laughs> there are What if they fall off? Yes. Samira will kill us. Yes. Okay. No, show us Samira. Where is Samira standing? Right here. <laughs> What is mom doing? She's gardening. And Papa is and Papa's watering the plants. Yes. Here's what they look like in the cage. They're all basking in the sun. Here is another set of goats. These are fenugreek leaves and these are the mustard leaves. <laughs> Here we have the piggies staring at us and eating their food. <laughs> These are cardamom plants. These are Chinese apple. <laughs>